want to be good. Well, you put uh, JB under the grill. They're going to put yes. you under the oh, under good. the same treatment. Like okay, this. you've got a problem, and when you get to that problem oh, now, look, you've, what's your problem? <laughs> well, you've you claimed <laughs> being flying, a, the fullback of the team of the century <laughs> for six flying. years until Gary exposed you. So that's one when little issue. Expose him. I stumbled across. You yeah, stumbled across it. it. We also know, and for those people who forget, two years ago we revealed on Triple M Footy that uh, at an AFL concussion research seminar, you were introduced to the gathering <laughs> and given a name tag with the words. Dr. Daniel Frawley on it. So that, that's all. It was a mistake. That's all established as fact. I want to go back two Thursday nights ago. So not the one just gone, but the one two prior Thursday, to that. Yeah, two Thursday. Yeah. Do you know where you may have been? I, I've got a yeah, fair idea. Okay, well, I'll tell you where you were. Yeah. You're, you're at the uh, Bridge Road Imaging Clinics launch. Yeah, Grand Dr. Ron White's mm, yeah. uh, uh, yes. new setup across the road from the Epworth. Yeah. 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 It, it, was a, it was a who's who of the medical world, and, and it was there was hardly oh. anyone from football in there. There was one person from football in there. Oh, don't tell yeah. me Dr. Frawley wanted it. <laughs> and there, there was a, a Nobel Peace Prize winner. There was a man who is the chairman of Australia's greatest and, and strongest mm. private health firm, Come a company on, worth... Four point five billions of dollars. There were doctors health, flown yep. in. There yeah. were doctors flown in from around Get the country. Point, yeah. We're talking, Gary. It's a who's who of the yes. medical world. There were yes. three guest speakers on the night. And two yeah. medical people. There was also a third person <laughs> who was introduced to the crowd Don't. as Dr. Daniel <laughs> no, Floyd. Again. Now look me in the eye. Spud. Is is that true? Spud. Sort of. Oh. <laughs> Spud. Sort of. Can now, be, can you do you this? Can't be introduced as a doctor. Now, <laughs> the I girl from Sydney has got that. no idea of AFL footy. Spud. The invites come do. down from Sydney, JB. Spud. What was I to do? Get that well, I don't know. Grab that bloody <laughs> trumpet and I'll get it over here. I'll give you an idea now. what you should do. I ain't a doctor. Spud. <laughs> did you? I, did you speak to the gathering as one of three? Keynote speakers. I was the keynote having speaker. Been, uh, having been introduced as Dr. Daniel Frawley. Well, I was the plenary speech of the night. I was all plenary. about. <laughs> Mate, it was and not spoke. just for the 10 minute speech you gave, yes. which I heard was a bit glass eyed, by the way. But no, it in, the, in the subsequent mingling amongst the guests after the speech, oh, did you at any stage seek to correct the fact that you weren't a doctor? <laughs> no, I didn't. Oh. Because... And did you engage oh, yourself oh. with doctors in conversations about medicine? Spud, oh, he's he's down oh, tools. Oh. He's grabbed hold of the warrior. Oh, no. He's pounding into the warrior. Oh. Jim, Jim. Look, poor old purple. He's being sat on as we speak. While those two punch on, let me just deal with this. Oh, right? I can't believe what I'm hearing. <laughs> the first time. No, no, no. This oh. is very serious. Oh, it's no. not serious. Impersonating oh. a doctor. It's, that's it's fraud. A no. <laughs> the first time I understand it. Oh. Some, you know, some poor fix? lady went, oh, Look. he must be a doctor. Spud, you can't go. Yeah, You're so talking about function. rotator cuffs and soleus and posterior yeah, so cruciates. I, I was introduced and I had my first line just embedded oh. in my brain. Oh, so your first line. Uh, I'm not a doctor. Yeah, no. it. <laughs> but I practiced in front of all these Spud. intellectual people and I, I must admit, it didn't sort of... I didn't hear it properly. That's an you know, indictable offence, but you have now a, a two-time offence. That's also known as fraud. Jim, <laughs> uh, at what stage do you reckon yeah, the Nobel Peace Prize oh. and uh, the bloke that invented the plastic here? Yeah, that's the that, like, After Spud being over two minutes, they would turn to each other and go, Spoke a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> they hand him out easy down here. <laughs> So it's eight years in the States. <laughs> I must admit, I spoke to Peter Gregg, the chairman of the Primary Health, for four and a half billion dollars. <laughs> he said... <laughs> he said, where did you study? <laughs> and I said to him... I said, oh, look, I've just got to go and have another drink. What would you like to drink, Peter? <laughs> I saw it. I was going to do after an hour and a half. I couldn't say no after that. He ate with his plug and lock of stuff. He came in with a bit of Louie. I was like, who's the doctor this bloke? You know, when I was operating on that bloke, I was under a pump. Oh, no. Spud, oh, you. you've got a problem, Spud. mate. You've got a problem. <laughs> Deal with it, please. <laughs> I think I'm on I it. I like it. I like it, Purple. Oh, nice work from you. What about comeback for you, well, The new top of the range, Olden Colorado Z71. This is the Saturday. My guts hurt.